Hey guys, it's Hefi. I'm back again and today I am doing my Pisces makeup look for the Geeks and Beauties Zodiac collaboration. I of course am a Pisces so this one is like completely up my street and I love greens and blues when it comes to makeup so I was only too happy to do a green look. It's got a little tiny touch of blue in the eyes. Um, actually just the mascara all the rest of it is green it's a very simple eye look pretty easy to do um, nothing too over the top the main thing is the lips the hair actually works really well for this particular look I have to say uh, yeah so if you want to know how I got this Pisces inspired look then keep on watching okay so I have got uh, my primer on and I have prepped my eyelids ready to start. I am going to begin with this Scandalize waterproof cream pencil in uh, Tempting Turquoise. I'm just going to put that on the mobile lid area and then use a small brush just to blend it a little bit we will be working with greens and tealy turquoisey type of colors which are colors that I really enjoy using um, and work really well for Pisces so I have actually been looking forward to doing this one because I am a Pisces and I actually really like these kind of colours. On the whole, so once I've got that blended out, I am then going to go into mainly what I'm going to be using is this little Alme quad that I got sent by um, Lena when I won her giveaway it is called Pegasus which I think is quite appropriate um, and I'm not really aiming at any of them in particular I'm just literally putting my brush like this because they're all very similar uh, light kinds of green so I'm just going to run that above where I've put that cream base and just blend it again I haven't done my base makeup just in case I get fallout I'm also planning on using glitter so you know that causes a fallout most of the time so just to be on the safe side and I'm actually going for a really quite simple look I'm not it'll just be quite monochromatic I'm not um, going to do anything super complicated That is literally pretty much all I'm doing on the top lash line. And then I'm going to take some NYX pigment um, glue stuff. It's going to squirt a little bit out on the back of my hand. I'm going to take a small brush. Gonna press it over mainly the central part of the mobile lid. I'm 
Let's give that a few seconds to go tacky. The uh, glitter I'm going to use is called Techno from Glamour Doll Eyes. Um, it's a kind of tealy, emeraldy, almost green. I'm going to use the same brush that I applied the glitter with, uh, applied the glue with. Just dip into it. And then press that where I put the glue. And then I'm going to go into um, whoops. Um, this one here, this is called Caribbean Sea. Uh, it's from uh, Girly Cosmetics. I'm just going to press it on the outside. I didn't do it first because I changed my mind as I was going on as to what I was doing like you do I'm just taking that up to the glitter on the outside I'm going to go back into the Alme And kind of put that on the inside a little bit okay so you've just got that little bit of glitter right in the center there nothing too extreme nothing too over the top uh, so now I am going to do my base major makeup and then I will be back Okay, so I have put on my base makeup, um, did a teensy bit of contouring, like the smallest amount. Um, I have sprayed my face already just to cut down the powderiness because um, I did set the foundation a little bit. Um, yeah, so underneath the eyes, I'm going to go in with this pencil. This is Teal Maybe from Models Prefer. I always end up with goobies in the corner of my eye. It is very annoying. Um, and I'm actually going to tightline my upper waterline with it as well. I normally would use a black, um, but really I'm just trying to meld in the, like stop the pink of my waterline from being quite so obvious. It might not be obvious on camera, but in person it is actually really obvious. Um, I am going to curl my lashes. I was originally going to align with black eyeliner, but I think I am not going to do that. I'm just going to leave it. I 
I am going to apply a coat of Big and Loud Lash Primer from NYX. And I'm putting that on both lashes. It's not super white. I've been looking for like a super white uh, lash primer or mascara to go under coloured mascaras. Yeah, I haven't managed to find anything at the drugstore, so... Um, and over that, I am actually going to use my Mega, Roll, Mega Volume Miss Baby Roll in Indigo. And I will put on a couple of coats of that. I used to love wearing blue mascara back in the day when I was a youngster. was my absolute favourite. Alright, on my cheeks, I am going to use um, Eliza from this uh, Pretty's For Your Face palette. Um, it's sort of a highlighter. Um, I'm not actually using blush. And... I don't know if fan brush is going to be the best option. Nope. Let's try this one instead. This has got quite a bit of uh, gold glitter in it as well as being kind of green. Um, I personally live for the weird coloured um, highlighters and stuff. I know a lot of people are like, oh, but they're not everyday wearable. And I'm, I'm like, well, actually, I think they're everyday wearable. And that's, you know, if that's what I choose to do, then, you know, it doesn't really matter if nobody else thinks it's okay. And I'm kind of using a bit like blush as well, which is why I'm actually like really going in it's also freaking gorgeous so there's that I'm just gonna put a bit on the cupid's bow yes there is a lot of I can see a lot of glittery fallout at the moment like gold glitter it's great I'm gonna take a small brush and I'm gonna go into this and put it under the eye as well this could quite easily be used as an eyeshadow. It's gorgeous. Um, this palette from Pretty's For Your Face is uh, Hamilton from Hamilton. I have not seen Hamilton. I just know that that's where this palette is from. <laughs> And I'm sorry if you keep hearing a weird sound. Um, my hand keeps hitting the microphone because it's literally right in front of me. Um, I'm putting a bit of that into the tear duct as well. So this is a very green look with a touch of blue. Um, I'm just going to put on another coat of mascara on my top lashes.
Okay, so on my lips, I'm going to take my nude lip liner. Not nude, um, clear. So it needs a sharpen first before I can use it. I'm just going to line my lips. Because I'm not using a natural colour. I mean, like, is anybody surprised at this point? So, on my lips, I am using the NYX Metallic, uh, sorry, Cosmic Metals in Electromagnetic, which is green. I love that color. Color makes me happy. And I know a lot of people don't like metallic lipstick, but I do. I think metallic lipstick is freaking gorgeous. So this is my Pisces look for the Geeks and Beauties Zodiac collaboration. Of course, everybody else involved will be linked down below. Make sure you go and check them out. Give me a thumbs up if you like makeup type look videos. If you want to subscribe, click the button down there. Click the little bell next to it so you get notified of when I upload new content. And leave me a comment down below. I will like your comment and I'll answer any questions you ask me. And I'll see you in my next video. See ya.